Hello and welcome. I'm Vincent McCory and this is Africa 54. Tonight, help and prayers are being offered for the victims of Super Typhoon Heian in the Philippines. An estimated 10,000 people have been killed and the death toll is likely to rise. Now, the devastating typhoon caused massive amounts of damage. Officials have begun to assess that damage and tally the dead. Many local residents are in dire need of clean water, food, and other basic necessities. Help is on the way, even though it may take some time to reach the victims. Germany has announced immediate aid of more than $650,000. Humanitarian organization World Vision and German airline Lufthansa have joined forces to fly emergency supplies to the island nation. U.S. forces joined the rescue and relief operation in the central Philippines Monday. President Barack Obama issued a statement Sunday offering condolences to the millions affected and pledged support in the form of, of uh, humanitarian aid and relief assistance. Super Typhoon Heian is believed to have destroyed about 70 to 80 percent of structures in its path in the central Philippines as it ripped across coastal provinces. Most of the damage and deaths were caused by huge waves that inundated towns and swept away coastal villages in scenes that officials likened to the 2004 Indian Ocean tsunami. U.S. Marines Brigadier General Paul Kennedy, who is on the ground in Laiti province, Philippines, says everything is significantly damaged or destroyed. General Kennedy says U.S. military aircrafts are ready to support the Philippines forces. We're going to move stuff as they direct. As the Philippine government and their armed forces ask us for, for support, I've got uh, airplanes and helicopters. I've got airplanes that can look uh, look for people in, in areas that are stranded. What so th that's people? what I do. I provide capabilities that, that are not resident here. Now, officials say rescue workers are have, were having difficulties sending the relief goods because roads, airports and bridges had been destroyed or were covered in wreckage.